His answer was short and meaningful. Meanwhile, the G Corporation has again launched another settlement program on Mars. CEO David Heckelman stated and I quote, In the past, we thought that buying the planet allowed us to do anything, but now we know that this is not what our employees expected us to do. We want to populate this planet again with the billions of people, listen we know what we did in the past, stop bitching about it, now you can trust us. In other news, platform Twitch.tv has been closed yesterday. Amazon Corporation, which owns the Twitch.tv, stated what is the reason for shutting down the platform. There was a time when we did not see a future in this type of product, but the market showed what is the need. We noticed a correlation between the release of cheap escort robots by G Corp and the decline in viewers of the Twitch platform. In other words, no one watches this shit anymore if they have a girlfriend at home. If this is true, then today millions of women aged between 10 to 32 will have to find a job. One of the most popular streamers called Oriental Chan loudly opposed the decision to close this platform. In her Twitter post, she complained that she had no skills other than sitting and sticking out for the camera and that there was no job on this planet for people with her education. We probably already know what kind of people will be inhabiting Mars in the near future. Did you watch Twitch before buying it? Yes. And if they hadn't closed it, would you still watch it? What for? I have an obedient girl at my own house who writes my name on her body with a marker. And did she has a personality or you just controlling her with a remote controller? Do you ask me did she is conscious then yes, but she likes to follow my instructions. So it's kind of like a housekeeper? Because I can see it's a maid model, is it? Yes, she is the cheapest model. But I do not complain, because she has everything in the right place, if you know what I mean. What do you mean? You know, her upper body and lower. Yeah, I can see that she has certain dimensions. Were there even larger sizes for her? There were, but the scalpers bought them immediately. You have to wait for a S cup. If you only knew how I hate these scalpers, we live almost in the year 3000 and they still getting away with it. Now I have to wait a year for my dreams to come true, it is simply unacceptable. I am telling you all these corporations have no concerns about their clients and what counts for them is money. Will she be standing here like this? Should I go away, master? Master? Stay right where you are, I like your warmth. Maybe you need to replace her fan if she is overheating. I already did, but it doesn't help, I need to send her to service. Maybe, or someone is mining the crypto on her. No, you can't mine on robots, I know something about that. Master. Should I wash the dishes? Yes. She has a cool butt, isn't she? Metal ass. It's not metal, but... I don't even know. Watch out before you get some kind of cancer. I will not get that. Speaking of which, does she have it, down there? She is not, after all, a... exotic model. Yes, she has everything. How so? She is a model for house chores, and no for, you know. Every maid must serve their master. Then why do all these companies release different variants on the market if you can buy the cheapest model and do it with it? It says that if you stick something down there, she will catch you and hold you, hostage, until you pay premium service, she will not let you go. Did you pay? No, I cracked her. And you are not afraid that one day? No, the guy who cracked it for me is a good dude, he even gave me a discount for e-cigarettes. Okay, but yesterday you said that you had a girlfriend, and today I find out that it's a robot. This is my girlfriend. You mean slave? No, she is a normal GF. So if I threw this plate on the floor and told her to clean it up, you guarantee me that she will not do it like an obedient maid? Dude don't do this. Then admit you just got a housekeeper and not a girlfriend. Do you even talk with her at all? Why should I talk to her? I don't know. Maybe because you telling me you are in a normal relationship with a plastic canned girl. She is not plastic. No one cares. So what are you talking about? About everything. Do you have any examples? How's my day? Or am I gonna eat something? Should she guide me to the bus stop? Don't tell me you got a robo mom. Maybe she's not a maid but a nanny. Piss off. 
Are you afraid that someone will steal her from you? When were they supposed to steal it from me? Like when she comes back alone from the shop. She can handle it. I wouldn't be so sure. She is upgraded and she has an improved GPS. So she is always online? What is wrong with it? You are not afraid that someone might hack into her, or the corporation might collect your data. And why would they collect it? Besides, I have nothing to hide. You have? I guess everyone does. You are laughing at me for being weird because I bought a robot and you're afraid to show what you're doing at home. Or maybe I just don't want to show my private life to others. G Corporation is very cool, did you see their Twitter account, they post funny memes. They are not so bad. So you are telling me that a multi-billion dollar corporation that dips its fingers everywhere all over the world and beyond the earth, a corporation that doesn't care about human rights, for which the most important thing, is that at the end of the year there are more profits, just so that investors can be reassured. A corporation that conducts human experiments. There was no proof for that. Because the process took place on Mars. But let them be, they're absolved because they'll send a meme on their corporate Twitter once a year. And what will you do when someone hacks her? They don't stand a chance because she's always online. Why always? It has to be because every once in a while, they send a random code online and she has to download it from servers and if they find some hacks they reboot her. So they sold you a product that deprives you of your right to privacy, and then they reassure you that this right has to be taken away from you for your own good. You can call it that. I don't even know if I should speak to you in front of her because they will reduce my credit score. Don't worry, they just shrunk me a little bit, but not too much, don't worry. There is no need to worry? Is there a receipt for what your score has been reduced? I got one. So what did they write? 7 times deviation, laziness, and sleeping until noon. Deviation 7 times? How so? You've had her since yesterday. I had to enjoy myself. And it doesn't bother you? For laziness and sleeping until noon, I got it before the purchase, so it doesn't make any difference to me. Maybe you should have to find a job. What for? I don't know, maybe so they wouldn't evict you. We'll worry about it later. Master, everything is ready. I have a request. Like what? Would you like to? You me and her? What? You know. I would like to experiment and you are like a brother to me so I don't mind. Sorry I have to go. Where? To work. What's that? Do you love me? Of course, I do master. Do you want me to love you now? Not yet. Tell me, do you have any dreams at all? Master. Are you asking me to lull you to sleep? This is what I am doing and if I am doing something wrong please tell me now, master. I hope I won't regret it. What happened? You fell asleep. I had a very strange dream. You had one? How was it? You, you tied me upside down, and then you, you. Don't be afraid, it was just a dream. Tell me do you love me at all? Why would I? Then why haven't you run away yet? Dunno. Maybe it's love. I do not know. Tell me, what will you do for breakfast tomorrow? Don't you have a pair of hands? You should use it. What are you gonna do for breakfast tomorrow? The thing you like the most, beetle omelette. My favorite. What are you doing? Stop. I'm ordering you to stop. No, 